I'm Dr. Del Meyer, physician in Sacramento, California. This week I'd like to talk about an item that comes in the news uh, periodically over the last decade. This is the SARS virus, the uh, SARS, um, the serious infection of the lung that starts off as a cold. Uh, when this first started in 2003, there was 800 people that died in China from this virus causing a great degree of concern throughout the world. It has appeared periodically in small clusters uh, ever since, and usually small clusters, which makes people think it's a, um, a, a transmissible disease like other viruses. The, um, recently, there has been 12 new cases in the world, and these have been people who have traveled to Pakistan and uh, Asia Minor, and there's been a couple in Britain. Um, there has been no great epidemic at this time, and uh, the World Health Organization, as well as our own uh, um, organizations, have said to be very concerned about any uh, outbreak of respiratory infections that seem a bit unusual. The SARS virus is really a, um, uh, a simple cold virus that uh, uh, causes the common cold. And it was thought that it was very serious in animals and was transmitted to humans. But now it looks like that uh, it's a uh, totally evolved human virus and uh, a quite serious one. And any time there is an unusual upper respiratory infection to be concerned, because if it's not cleared in a few days, you sh uh, may need to be on life support. And uh, many of these people have died. Um, of the 12 cases that have uh, SARS virus this year, five have uh, already died, and they've been in Saudi Arabia and, and uh, Jordan. Uh, SARS is a, um, a coronavirus, the same virus that affects uh, humans in all kinds of re upper respiratory infections, and um, uh, is a bit different and uh, is uh, difficult to uh, identify, uh, but uh, this should be done. And, if there's ever a uh, suspicion for that. So uh, the uh, SARS virus causes uh, primarily pneumonia as it advances from a common cold into the lungs and then if it becomes more severe it uh, uh, goes, uh, one goes into respiratory failure and then must be placed on life support. So it can become very serious. So the takeaway thing is if you have a common respiratory infection that is not so common, last a bit longer than it should, it might be wise to obtain the services of your physician. That's it for now. Be sure to subscribe to my channel. Please post any comments below. So until next time, take care.